be. Okay. Hey Mountain Family, how's it going? So before I start this video, do you like the new camera? Like, the quality is so different, I'm like, I can't like stop looking at the viewfinder. I need to stop doing that, but I'm like, oh my gosh, it looks so much better. It is like worlds different from vlogging on a iPad <laughs> or a phone, <laughs> which I'm so used to. So I'm like looking up like, oh my gosh. <laughs> anyway, so I'm going to apologize for the lack of editing in this video. I am so super busy today. I've been just going from thing to thing to thing and I just finally had to tell myself, okay, you're just going to have to sit down <laughs> and do this vlog. Dinner's going to be a little bit late tonight, but I got to sit down and do this vlog. I'm sure you guys are wondering like where I've been, if I'm coming back, what's going on. So I'm going to like get you guys a little bit up to speed. I haven't vlogged I think my last one was when Andy turned five months old and she's now six months old as of two days ago. Yes, two days ago she turned six months old. I know it's been a while, it's been like a month, but uh, it's just been like stuff on top of stuff that just accumulated and I got really down and my glasses are kind of distracting. So I have on, no, I just don't have on makeup and my hair is not fixed today, sorry. <laughs> is it ever? <laughs> anyway, um, it's just been stuff on top of stuff. Uh, to start with something you guys already know about, um, our house is not fixed and the entryway wall still needs fixed, the bathroom floor that you guys already know about needs fixed, and what's the other thing? I feel like I'm missing something. There is one other thing. Oh, the living room floor, which you guys already know about. That also needs to be fixed. Our landlord keeps telling us, I'm going to get it fixed and someone's coming over on this day on this time. It's happened like three times now. Someone's coming over on this day and this time. They never show up. At this point, I don't know if I'm just being lied to or if someone actually is like supposed to be here and they just never showed up. Three times though? Hmm. So someone's supposed to be here Friday. We'll see if that happens. So there's that. Uh, something I haven't told you guys. Uh, Devin got hit by a semi like six weeks ago. Not huge. He's fine. Don't think that he's like in a hospital. <laughs> he's fine. But uh, I'm going to try to like show you guys. Okay, so Devin was coming this way on a road and the semi was coming this way so they were coming like, you know, that way. And uh, the semi was too far into Devin's lane. So the semi sideswiped Devin. At least, I read the police report and I've heard Devin tell this story like a million times. So I hope I'm saying this right. He got sideswiped. He ran it. He got into a ditch. Uh, he did what practically anybody would do and called the cops and the driver got mad at him for calling the cops and swung at him and almost hit him. So there was an almost assault. He's talked to, I don't even know how many lawyers, a couple, a few, I'm guessing, and none of them will take the case because insurance won't pay for anything. Their insurance won't pay for squat. We had to meet our deductible for our insurance and our car is in the shop right now to get fixed. So it's kind of <laughs> messy. Uh, Devin is at the point where he wants to just file everything himself and do everything himself. I keep telling him not to because judges don't really like for you to do that. People go to law school for a reason. You don't really know how to conduct yourself in a courtroom, really, without doing that. So there's that. Um, I had like a week and a half straight where I was in a really bad depressive episode. It was, oh my gosh, it was awful. It was like, I don't know how to even like gauge it. So I'm going to just try. Like, uh, if this is planning to do something bad, I was here. Not that I ever would. Don't freak out. I have kids. I love my kids. I will never, ever, ever in a hundred million years, I don't care how bad it gets, I will never leave them. I love them so much. But to like give you an idea of like where I am or where I was emotionally, this is like the best way I can give it to you. <laughs> so anyway, this is planning to do something bad and I was like right here. Like, and I, I don't know about you all, but I just can't stop thoughts when they come to me. Like they just happen and they're just there. Uh, so 
I, I had a depressive episode for like a week and a half straight. It was terrible. That happened. Oh my gosh, what else has happened that I can catch you guys up with? Uh, Kenley is having more issues. I'm going to have to get into that when I do her two-year-old update. She turns two this Friday. Today's Wednesday. So I'm wanting to do that Monday. I'll update you guys then on what's going on and what I'm going to talk to her pediatrician about. I will do all of that. So there's Kenley. Andy is starting to follow the same growth pattern as Kenley, so there's that stress. Oh my gosh, what else? <laughs> oh, Dev and I have been having some marital issues. I don't want to go into it too much. Just, I just don't want to put that much of my marriage out there. I just feel like that, that gives people a lot of room to criticize you or basically make a situation that is already kind of a struggle between the two of you already or something that you're already dealing with it just adds to it I don't need anyone to add to it so I'm trying to I'm gonna try to make this vague but we're having marital issues and it's been accumulating and it got to a point and uh, we were just in a bad place for a while uh, we're getting better things are kind of on and up but if you've been married for a while uh, you know that you go through like ups and downs in your marriage, or at least a lot of people do. You go through ups and downs, and we were just at a down. So there was that, because you know, having a depressive episode wasn't enough. So it's just been a lot of stuff, you guys. I'm, I hope that covered everything. I think it did. Um... Oh, my, oh, here's another one, because, you know, I don't have enough. Uh, my OB office is taking its sweet old time getting my IUD to me. I had an appointment on my birthday, June 27th. It's August, no it's not, it's August 9th. I still don't have it. I had to call my OB office today, ask where the crap my IUD is. They told me that they don't have the authorization yet, called my insurance. They told me that they don't have the paperwork even to authorize anything. Had to call my OB office back, tell them that they need to actually call them, get the paperwork, fill it out, send it back so the authorization can happen. <laughs> Basically, I've had to hold everybody's hand. It's been fabulous. So anyway, insurance issues with things going on. Uh, Ken, or not Kenley, Carly has to have a tooth pulled. That's a whole other thing I have to tell you guys about. See, like, it's been stress. So much has happened, like, all at once. And I love vlogging. I really do. I've missed it. I missed you guys. And it's, it's like the only thing I do that is for me. Like the only thing. I am either mom mode or wife mode. <laughs> and there are very, very, very few things I do for myself. This is one of them. I've missed it. But I've just been so stressed and I've been in such a bad place with a lot of things that I just haven't, haven't had the energy. I just honestly haven't. I haven't had the energy and, uh, you know, there are some things with my channel that have kind of gotten me down. Like, I'm not nearly growing at all like I used to. When I was pregnant with Andy, my channel was growing very well. Like, every month it was in the plus and it was great. And then I had her in February and boom! Just dead stop. Actually, uh, to make things just a little bit worse, it actually went down a little bit. I actually lost subscribers uh, pretty consistently for two, three months before I finally got up again. So, I mean, in groups, YouTube groups, they tell you all the time, if you don't do it all the time consistently, and then you just don't love it enough. And I'm like, no, 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 no. It's okay to pour your heart and soul into something and desperately want to see it grow and want to see it flourish. And it's okay to feel disappointed if that doesn't happen or if it's taking longer to happen than you thought. Like, that's okay. Uh, that's not why I stopped <laughs> vlogging, but uh, it doesn't help. <laughs> and I, I've, had dis I've had disappointments before and I've just kept going. So obviously not the only reason, but you know, it was just one thing on top of another. Like one more. <laughs> so I am coming back. I'm gonna change my schedule because it's becoming very obvious to me that having Borderline, borderline, no I don't. Having bipolar depressive dis... See, I can't talk today, guys. I can't, I can't do it. Bipolar disorder type two, having that, um, plus trying to be on a Monday through Friday schedule, that is every single day except the weekends. Trying to do that is really, really hard. I am not like other YouTubers who have depression and can still vlog even though they are depressed. I can't do that. 
when I'm depressed, I can't do squat. I absolutely do the bare minimum. I keep telling myself that I'm going to vlog one of my depressive down days just to like show you guys what it feels like to be in that place and you know, like what I can do that day, which is usually the bare minimum, like take care of my kids, feed us, change us, that's about it. <laughs> uh, but every time, without fail, that I have a depressive day, I don't have the energy. I don't want to pick up my camera. I just, I don't. <laughs> so I'm going to switch to a Monday, Friday, Monday, Friday, Monday, Wednesday, Friday schedule. And I think I'm going to make Wednesday, not Wednesdays. See, can't talk. I think I'm going to make weekends optional. Like if I, you know, have a video that I want to do that week uh, that I don't want to put off into the next week, I'll, put, I'll post it on a Saturday or Sunday. But I have a much better camera now. I have a editing software and you know, people with cameras editing softwares can like punch out videos. So I don't know, maybe things will be different now that I actually have a camera <laughs> and a really good memory card. So, I mean, we'll just see, we will see. But uh, for now, until I get into the groove of like <laughs> vlogging again and being one of those people who have like scores of videos just stored up for when they have a bad day and they just boop post. I don't know if that'll happen, but for now, it's going to be Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Please ignore my intro and my banner on my channel. Please ignore that. I just don't feel like changing it for a temporary time because I might want to switch back to Monday through Friday. It's just Monday, Wednesday, Friday is going to be for now. So, that's where we're at. That's what we're doing. I'm so sorry I've been gone for so long. I'm not exactly proud of it, <laughs> but Hi. hey, it is what it is. Life happens whether you're a YouTuber or not. Hi. I mean, it just happens. And I'm not one of those YouTubers who's going to not be real with you all. So I will see you guys on Friday. I will do Andy's six month update. Monday will be Kinley's two year update. And then I'll start doing like daily vlogs again of like our daily life and things because I don't think I really have anything yet to make a video of. Oh yes I do. I have to do my uh, what's in my backpack. I want to do that vlog so bad and I also want to do um it's coming to me. Just give me a second. It's coming to me. No it's not. I have another video. It's just not coming to me but there's two I want to do but I still want to do like a daily life vlog. So uh Two update videos and a daily life vlog is coming up. I'm so sorry, guys. I will see you guys soon. Bye, guys.